the guitar solo on the bass? <laughs> well, that's quite a challenge here. He did the artificial harmonic, awesome. Oh yeah, and that's an evil face. He has a dog on his lap while he's playing this cover. This morning, I decided spontaneously to uh, search fan covers to make a playlist on my YouTube channel and I was overwhelmed because I found so many. Um, yeah, and I put them together in a playlist and I want to take you on a journey now watching those videos with me, at least some of them, and you will see how they interpret songs differently that I had to uh, record and uh, to hear different sounds. And yeah, there are quite some interesting videos I can tell you. So let's go. Ah, that's only the bass part of the song. Ah, and because he has only a four string fretless bass, he uh, uh, transposes some notes an octave lower. That's smart. Oh yeah, he even shows his setup in the background. That's, that's cool to see. That's uh, the song Sense of Lust by my new band Obsidious, by the way. Ah, oh, and that's a fretless bass. It's not a fretted bass, those are just markers. Oh yeah, and that's an evil face you're doing there. Yeah. Like that, he understands the vibe of the song. Yeah, that's very cool. He plays his own bass lines for this song. This has barely anything to do with I, uh, what I played on that record. Very nice. Fits very well. This is for my band Alkaloid, by the way. And I think a lot of people have a bat in the background in those covers. It seems to be a thing. Yeah, and he understands the song very well. Very cool. Another six string fretless bass, cool. Great tone. And this is exactly what I play on the record, I think. Nice. I can remember it took me very long to find a good bass idea there. I jammed a lot on that track. Oh yeah, that's hard to intonate. He did the artificial harmonic! Awesome! I love that on fretless basses, so cool. I like how he writes down the time signatures. Not really a good video quality, but the song quality is good. Nice tone again. Oh yeah, that was nice. That's also not how I played on the record, as far as I remember. He plays the guitar solo on the bass? <laughs> well, that's quite a challenge here. Very cool. It sounds great on bass, actually. like that approach a lot. And he has a panther on the bass. What else do you want? Oh yeah, that took some time to practice, I can imagine. Nice. That's not what I expected when I clicked on this video. Very, very good. I think that's the first riff I ever wrote for Obscura back then. It's a beautiful black bass. Like that is black everywhere. Oh, and he uses three fingers on the right hand. Yeah, 
Hey, we know you. You are the guy who also made the Sense of Lust video in the beginning. Oh, that's an interesting animation. Is this a hand? I think so. And I guess he needed to fill that pause, I guess. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I also think you had to fill that like space there with a green skull mask. Is that an Iron Maiden Eddie mask? No, I don't think so. Cool. <laughs> well, uh, you understand the intention of the part. And that song works totally on a fretted bass as well. That's good. Hey, that's an Ibanez BTB676. It's the same bass that hangs in the background here. It's, it's the bass I, uh, I, re I played most live shows of Obscura with and recorded a lot of material. But I had a custom Fatness version of it. It's great to see that bass again. <laughs> Wait, what is happening here? He has a dog on his lap while he's playing this cover. <laughs> I wonder if he put it, the dogs there on purpose or if they just were hanging out there. <laughs> yeah. The dog seems very into metal. <laughs> I can't concentrate on the song at all. I just see the dogs. Are those the same kind of dogs? Anyway, they seem to be pretty chill. Oh, they play as a duo, I like that. Oh, are those not some pickups on this face? I think so. And I like the nature in the background, I wish we would have that kind of nature in Germany as well, right now. But it's cold and dark outside and gray. Yeah, another bassist who smiles while he's playing. I like that. He enjoys what he enjoys what he's doing, and he plays very precise. Nice. Also there, that's not easy to play. Yeah, and all the ghost notes, cool. And the harmonics, he plays all I have uh, composed for the bass line there. I never heard of the bass brand that he's playing. Yeah, he's playing great. I think playing while this is my favorite so far. And he has the same glasses, I think, are very comparable glasses. Oh, we have another bat in the background. I can barely see his face with all the hair. Ah, and he should have known that you can download play alongs to the songs. But sounds cool on uh, further bass with heart. Another very different sound to what I did. I like that. Yeah, I also like that you can see in his face expression that he enjoys it. Cool. Oh yeah, his camera is too slow for his hands. <laughs> Another six string fretless bass, so cool. That's also what I played on the record. It's the same bass line. Oh, almost, I think. But yeah, he makes his own interpretation. Good. It sounds heavy for a fretless bass. Great. That's another Ibanez PDB 676, the bass from there, just as a 5 string version. Oh, 
Oh, he also did use the play along and plays his own bass line, his own arrangement on it. Oh yeah, that's the opener of uh, Diluvium. We never play that song live. Oh, the bass solo. The song. Cool. I think that's hard to, fr uh, to uh, I don't know, interpret that on the fretted bass. It's very, it's composed very much for a fretless bass. And it's another guy with a lot of beard and a lot of hair. I hope he uses that to headbang on stage. That good timing feel. Oh yeah, that's a cool riff, Raphael Road. Is he left-handed or is that just a mirrored video? So this was just a small list of videos that are in my playlist that you can check out on my YouTube channel. But it was so interesting for me to see the different sounds and different interpretations of the stuff that I recorded once. Very cool. If you want to play some stuff yourself, uh, please go um, on my website or on obsidius-band.com. There you can find uh, tabs and play alongs. And if you made a cover already that was not included in my playlist or my video, please send me a message. Maybe I make another video like this at another moment and uh, yeah, enjoy the bass and thanks for watching.